Hi and welcome to this video. Today I did a model of the cyclic load over the uh, steel column uh, and we used a reinforcement for this column as the chair steel part, the bolt and the bolt also inside the concrete foundation. We have a bed plate here, you can see that. And here also it is the same. Let me click on animate. This is the stress. And let me remove the concrete. Just check the steel. See, this is the sorry, this is the deformation under the cyclic loading with the static approach. You can see here the local buckling which happened here here you can see that this uh, local bucklings and now we can check the yield criterion you can see these reds are the element which reach the yield address and we can say they don't have more resistance against the load and you can see them here and if I check for instance the displacement anything else now let me replace the concrete see the concrete with ACL you can see and now let me remove here just let here see see these buckling's here and the deformation in H cycle the stress plastic strain or the formation so we use uh, CDP uh, as a material model for the concrete tension and compression behavior separately and for the column uh, we should use the specific type of the hardening in the plasticity section you can see that the cyclic uh, loading, because in the cyclic loading we have changing in the yielding surface and in the edge surface we have <coughs> a little bit uh, residual strain and the abacus should consider that so kinematic, combine and the other plasticity can uh, be useful for this model. Also we have the Heisterzis diagram, Heisterzis diagram here in H cycle. This is the maximum load between this displacement and under some cycles you will have this. Also we can neglect the concrete here, just the steel part, but it is the full model. You can also add a stiffener, a stiffener in the middle of the steel column, in the middle of the bolts uh, to have a better performance, you know. But here this is the uh, good model of the cyclic loading of this complex complex structure you can see uh, that we you can use also damage besides the uh, hardening to observe the damaged area you know uh, because we have damaged area also here for instance here here and here also in the concrete so if you want to provide this tutorial step by step you can come to our website here uh, www.abacusfm.com find the english tutorial here this is the english tutorial of this example of this tutorial click on this or blue sign then you will have a page here the title the part definition step interaction load and then the result as figures you can see them so 
uh, you can provide CA INP and English video file step by step and you can purchase for this tutorial by using a PayPal account, Visa or MasterCard. Uh, if you want this tutorial, contact me to this email uh, to tell you about the purchasing process and give you the payment link. Also we have a full package. Uh, this full package contains more than 400 tutorials in all uh, in in all simulation in all thing I want to say it is about all thing in Abacus uh, finite element or CFT or thermal analysis anything you can see the titles here and it contains more than 400 you know crack CFT thermal cyclic loading discrete element everything concrete steel seismic load electromagnetic everything each file contains CIP paper and step-by-step step 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 English video and the cost for that is so affordable for all buyers. So uh, if you want to buy this full package, contact me also to this email and then I will tell you about the purchasing process. Thank you for your attention.